All right, so today I think we have three cells. First thing is this PS2 uh, slim, but that's the black one. That's bigger than black and white. The silver one, which is right here. I'll have to move these boxes. All right, so here is the PS2. It's all in there. There's the remote. And as you can see, it's right there. It's a silver PS2, PS2 Slim. Reason why it's in this box, cause it was ready to pack on eBay, but um, someone bought it on Facebook Black Market for 115 bucks. And I think I paid, yeah, I paid 50 bucks for this PS2 like a month or two ago. So I'm making, I'm doubling my money. Next is in the C bin. I sold this in less than like three hours. Like I posted this at 10 o'clock at least or something like that and it sold at midnight. And it's a Karate Kid PSP UMD. It's a movie for the PSP. Um, basically I paid a dollar for this and it sold for five free shipping. I'm not making a lot of profit. But this is one of those items that I didn't think was going to sell. So I just list it just to like get rid of it. Because I bought this with another PSP game. But I mainly bought this for the other PSP games. Just, this just came with it. So I was just trying to get rid of it. But at least I'm still making my money back. Or at least a little bit of profit. So this for 5 bucks, Free shipping. And our third item... It's probably gonna be in this stack of boxes somewhere. It's a VHS. Yeah, it's right there at the bottom. I'll have to move all these boxes. All right, so here is the final thing I have to ship. I'm not gonna open this box because it's ready to ship, but as you can see, it's a Edward Scissors scissor hand VHS sealed. Believe it or not, I sold this for 30 bucks. I paid like one or two bucks for it. Believe it or not, a lot of people collect sealed VHS and I think they get them graded. I'm not sure. I know it's a thing that people collect, but here are the three items I'm shipping today. We got once again, the Karate Kid PSP movie, the Edward Scissor hand, VHS and the PS2 Slim Silver. All right, next thing I sold is this camera right here. Let me get it out. So it's a Polaroid Sun 600 camera. These cameras are pretty old, but they're pretty cool. Like you open them like that. And apparently there's a little square picture that comes out. I don't really know how it works, but uh, I listed this for 20 bucks and I got an offer of 10 bucks and I just accepted it because this is one of them things that was just in my basement. We don't know if it works or not. So I'd rather get 10 bucks than nothing. All right, another day, another sale. Um, this morning I sold this pack of guitar strings. Not really making a lot of profit on these. Uh, these have been sitting on this shelf for a long time. Paid five bucks for these and I sold them for eight bucks. Making like three bucks profit. Today, um, I have to, I have to ship four items. Um... Oh. First one is a DVD. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? There it is. Let's say wrestling DVD. I don't want this to stack the fall here. There you go. It's the WWE AWA DVD. I think I paid one dollar for this. And um, it's sold for around $20. The price will be on the screen. But anytime you see uh, wrestling DVDs, usually they're good pickups. 
when they're old. The more old they are, the more value they, they have, which is common sense. What well, duh. Um, next, we got two Wii games. These two right here. These sold pretty quick. Um, this is not a big one. Uh, I paid four bucks for this, and it sold for around 10 bucks. The price will be on the screen again. But yeah, this I'm not making a lot of profit on this, but I did not know before buying it. I thought this would sell for a lot higher, but still I'm not losing any money, so that's all good. And next uh, we have Wii Party, which is a pretty good game if you ever see this in a thrift store or any kind of store, because this resells for around 40 to 50 bucks if it has the manual. Mine does not. I'm sure I could have sold it for a lot more, but I received an offer of 25 bucks and I just accepted it because I like selling stuff quickly and I just paid four bucks for this. So I'm still, so I'm still making profit, you know? So we got these three right here, really easy to ship. You just put them in an envelope and padded envelope or whatever you want to call them and they'll be good. Next is in the A bin. And this sold pretty quick, actually. It sold in less than 24 hours. Uh, a Bonk's Grip. This is from Japan, as you can see here, designed in Japan. And for these, there's not a lot of information on the internet. Um, I think on eBay, there were like two or three listed, and they were like 400 bucks coming from Japan. So... I, in my local thrift store, I saw these, and when I say these, because I have two more in my room over there, and when I saw these, I only bought one at first, just to see, just to see if it would sell quickly, and I told myself, if it did sell quickly, I would go back and pick the other two up, and that's what I did, uh, this sold in less than 24 hours, and basically, I didn't tell you guys what it was, it's like a sports, um, bluetooth earbuds thing to talk with like other people let's say y'all biking together you put this on and you can just communicate i think i'm not really sure that's i think that's what i got from it but yeah uh i paid 40 bucks for this and it sold for 100 dollars or 101 dollars something the price will be on the screen anyway but yeah it sold for around 100 dollars on ebay put this right here but i'm gonna show you guys the other two i bought so that's what i was saying uh as soon as i saw that that sold in less than 24 hours i went to my local thrift store and bought the other two ones this one is green and this one is pink so i'm pretty sure these will sell quickly so if you ever see bonk's grip in your store they have a lot of value and yeah, as you can see, I still have a lot of stuff to post on eBay and Facebook and Kijiji and all those sites. So the hustle never stops. But yeah, this is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it and at least learned something. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a good day and keep hustling. Peace.